watching New York One News All Day. This is New York Living on stage. An award winning playwright and a not for profit performing arts organization are teaming up to open some theatrical doors for city high school students. New York's Clover Lalazar has the story. This past Monday night marked the sixth annual graduation of Open Doors, a theater mentoring program for city high school students founded by award winning playwright Wendy Wasserstein and supported by the Theater Development Fund, the folks who sponsor the half price TKTS booth. I grew up in Manhattan going to plays and I, I do believe it's the right of every kid growing up in New York to see plays. So I went to TDF and I said, okay, I've got a plan. I want to take eight kids from a public high school in New York. I want smart kids who are not particularly interested in the theater. Kids maybe who have never seen a play before in their lives. I want to see, is the theater still relevant to them? Are we really, you know, barking up the wrong tree? And let's see, and I will take them to the plays and then afterwards so we'll sit and talk for an hour and a half. We'll have a seminar like they do at like the great prep schools, like they do at Exeter. Going to Broadway plays is only the beginning. Open Doors offers a rich mentoring program. The mentors include some of the industry's most esteemed professionals, from New York Times columnist Frank Rich to recent Tony Award winning choreographer Kathleen Marshall. Together they see six performances for the year, complete with post performance discussions and journal writing. I think it's wonderful and it's something that every student, if it's able to, they should experience this. And um, it's opened a lot of doors for me as far as acting. I love going to see Broadway plays. I love. Um, interacting with the different people. And while the students have a lot to learn from their mentors, it's no surprise that education can work both ways. It was a revelation, both from what they thought the theater was going to be and their fears of it and their assumptions about it and my assumptions about them to really how much the theater affected them, how much they loved it, you know? And at the end of the year, I said, well, do you think we should do this again? And they said, yes, absolutely. And it wasn't just about going to plays, it was about feeling a part of New York in a way that they never had, that they thought, well, the Broadway district is my district too, you know? And that was so important to me. Keeping the theater alive depends on creating new and varied audiences. Audiences that might have never gotten the chance to see anything if the doors hadn't been wide open. For more information on the Open Doors program, you can log on to tdf.org. Clover Lalazar, New York One.